Welcome to Varnberg Implement pre-owned video. Today we're here with a 2015 Massey Ferguson 7624. This is a customer consignment. We sold this thing new to a customer. He is retired from farming and we're going to help him sell it. This is a 240 max engine horsepower tractor. It's 220 ISO horsepower and it's 180 on the PTO. Um, if you notice by the number, the 7600 is a series, the 24 is, you put a zero behind it, that is your 240 max engine horsepower. This tractor is fitted with these big giant flotation Michelin tires. Um, this gives you a lot of traction across the ground, more flotation. He planted with it, did tillage, some tillage work with it, but man, this thing would make a great baling tractor, if especially on alfalfa uh, planting tractor. Going to reduce the compaction. On the front, we have the 710 55R30 Michelin tire there. On the backs, we have the 950 R42s got two sets of external wheel weights plus on the inside we have two more sets in there so it's got four wheel weights on both sides of the tractor big beefy tractor man this thing is a beautiful tractor it's going to be hard to find another one this nice and this low of hours this thing only has uh, 758 hours on it got the external three-point raise and lower switches PTO stop switch got four sets of remote valves it's got the power beyond hydraulics to run your planter that's your top link bracket there got the quick hitch on it got your PTO gonna have your 540 and a thousand big and small thousands got your clevis drawbar does have hydraulic cab suspension on this tractor this tractor straight from the farm got rear wiper there big wide extended fenders got your three-point raise and lower on this side got your breakaway mirrors out here this is your auxiliary hydraulics on this side your back your rear is checked in the back battery box down here agco power engine super clean super fuel efficient pivoting fenders got the wide pivoting fenders to cover that tire uh, this tractor would go down the road super nice and smooth uh, push the button and raise the hood got your air cleaner up here it's got the uh, compressed air cleaner, got the opening in here to make it easy to clean out, got your condensers, your radiator, and there's your left hand side of the engine, fuel filters, engine oil filters all on this side. Got the quad link suspended front axle. This tractor will go 33 mile an hour down the road. It's got the high speed CVT to it. So. You got a super fast tractor. This sucker is fully featured and stuff. Uh, got fuel tank, got DEF. This does have the dual knock sensor DEF system that only uses DEF if it needs to. It's not like a lot of the competition dumping it in there. Um, no matter what the RPMs is. If you're not creating NOx gases, we're not using DEF with Massey Ferguson. Uh, you've got dual knock sensor. There's one that's right up there. There's your dosing module you can see back there. It does the diesel oxidation catalyst in this system here. This is the downstream sensor that's going to read the results of the cleansing. If it cleans it up too much, it reduces the amount. It only uses DEF when you, the amount you need to. This is a six cylinder version. Agco power engine. These suckers are fuel sippers torque generating super awesome tractor man we're going to pull down the hood take it for a spin jump up here in the cab show you what all we know about it um, 
you're gonna be hard to find a nicer tractor comes with a two-door cab got the buddy seat here got the swivel seat see it in the swivel position right now you can swivel right or left got the T handle here controller got two fingertips and two mechanicals for the four total remote valves that's your hydraulic activation your P electronic PTO switch you've got your can cooler up here when it's blowing cold air it's blowing cold air through here radio auxiliary input standard air conditioning controls does have the fold down sunshade there internal mirrors two external mirrors your rear wiper washers here all your windows open except the windshield that's your side there spin this around your back window opens that's your rear wiper speakers fuses and relays are back here got 12 volt power port you've got uh, your ISO power port back here three point raise and lower there's your raise and lower there's your depth control SV1 is a speed and velocity control that you can set a basically a preset engine uh, preset ground speed preset engine speed headlands management we can set that up in the dash control center up here uh, to do a second SV1 or SV2 you've also got tilt and telescopic it'll tilt by pushing the button forward pull it back and it'll come out the whole console comes out with you push it in and you can see we pushed it back in um, pretty awesome simple tractor got the Agco CVT transmission in it this transmission features zero clutches zero clutch packs um, it is a Fent CVT made by our sister company Fent of Germany um, Agco owns them 100% they control production 100% so put the key in here and fire it up we just drop this down a little bit tractor that's showing the tractor software release the parking brake and it goes to shows the park this screen over here by using this control pad down here we can go through multiple screens there's your aggressiveness of your SV1 SV2 Ford reverse shuttle pedal mode turbo clutch the top one is uh, or the second one down is brake to neutral you can hit the OK key and turn it on uh, the power shuttle lever is up there on the top we can go through more you can correlate SV1 SV2 with engine speeds many headlands functions here we can turn our auto guide on this is an auto guide ready tractor if we hit OK we can select SV2 which allows us that second cruise control function by just pushing one button uh, this is engine management this is power management this is the total fuel we've used 2794 gallons of fuel and 117 gallons of DEF um, gallons per hour is 0.8 gallons per hour of use uh, cab suspension control AB there's your response control of your engine uh, many headlands this is wheel slippage PTO control or three-point controls lots of functions available in this uh, this dash control center hours voltage um, that's your hours to your next service that is your fuel and your def use percentage on the right hand side we use the top circle key here that is is your hour 758.4 this is your PTO speed 
This is your engine RPMs. I revved it up there. You can see it changed. Hit the cycle again. That is ours to the next service. We need to turn our, we've got 1000 PTO on, so we turn the button on here. Now when we engage it, you see our PTO, we're at 520, we'll move the throttle on up. And we're at, right at 1000, there's your 1000 PTO speed. You want to come off of it, tap it once over here, takes it to off position and then when it's down to zero you can go ahead and put it into a brake position. Uh, let's just drive this thing, man. These things are awesome to drive. Um, there's a couple different ways you can do it. You can hit your home key back here. We've got it in joystick mode. The stick mode is either using this or your power controller, your third fu your three function power shuttle. So we can put it in reverse and you feel it going back. I can increase the speed here. If I want it neutral, I can pull up on the control lever and it'll go into neutral position. If we want to go back, we can also hit brake to neutral since we had that turned on. That stops the tractor. When I let go of the brakes, the tractor will start moving again. If you want to go to forward, you can go to forward and you can adjust your speed by bumping that lever. That's all you have to know to run an Agco CVT. It's simple, smooth, easy to use. Now, there's some more advanced functions. We can do SV1, which we've got right here. When we're at 1500 RPMs. SV1 kicks in, we're at 0.1 mile an hour. This is basically 60 feet per hour. Now that I've activated headlands as SV2, we're gonna go to four and a half mile an hour. There's our four and a half mile an hour. Go back to SV1, and we've got it pretty aggressive. Uh, and you need to do that at 1500 RPMs. Now, you can come over here, SV1, SV2. This is how we're going to change our speed control. You can see the speed control. There's S2, 5, 1 mile an hour. This is, this control right up here takes us into foot pedal mode. Foot pedal mode, the tractor stays in a neutral position until you activate the foot feed. We can change ground speed by our foot feed. The more I push down, the faster it goes. Want to go to reverse, throw it in reverse, and foot pedal mode is going to take me backwards. Forward and reverse. You don't get that shift shock, you don't have shifts. This is an Agco CVT, it's not one of those imitations like the others have. The biggest change is your how aggressive you want it set up to start and stop. And that's done through that dash control center. The CVT has got so many awesome features and ways to operate it and work it and make it work. One of the cool things is dynamic tractor management. I call that the money maker. When you have dynamic tractor management on, it's gonna figure out how much engine RPM based on the speed that you want to travel. And we can see over here we're running a thousand twenty RPMs doing everything we need and just tooling along. It'll change the, RP the RPMs based on how much work you need to do. It uh, It's a great feature. Gives you a lot of options, a lot of versatility allows you to save a lot of fuel and your DEF usage too. That's part of the Agco package 
is the CVT, the Echo Power Engine, and Dynamic Tractor Management all working together for you. We, uh, this is a super nice tractor, man. It turns nice and short. We'll uh, jump up here, set up the tripod, and uh, let you take a look at it in action in front of the camera. Come check out this Massey Ferguson 7624. It's a 2015 model. Super nice, low hour tractor. You're not going to find a nicer one in the country. I guarantee it. This is a one of a kind find. Available at Varnberg Implement. We sold this tractor new. The customer is retired. Um, he's not row crop farming anymore. And we're going to help him sell it. He's been such a great customer of ours over the years. We're here to help him get the most out of his, his awesome investment in this high-class tractor, man. This sucker is full of features, awesome big tires that do a lot of flotation, man. There's a lot of advantages to these big tires. If you're looking for a great tractor to put on your farm and help you grow your operation, you got to come check out this Massey Ferguson 7624 at Varnberg Implement. We're located right here at 13 Highway and Business 13 in Higginsville, Missouri. 
We're the first stoplight from the south from Interstate 70, which is just four miles down the road here. We're about 50 miles east of Kansas City. We've got a lot of used tractors. Uh, this is our only big one right now, but we've got new Massey Ferguson's Rhino Ag implements and Massey Ferguson Heston built hay tools in stock, ready to help your needs. Come check us out at Varnberg Implement.